view. This is brand new. You're seeing it for the first time. It's new. It's $79.75. Again, we have three flex pays. Our colors are going to be... Dun, dun, dun. Oh, we had to do the stitched one. Which one are we doing, guys? Are we doing the cable or are we doing the waffle stitch? We're doing the waffle stitch. This is the waffle stitch. Okay, I got See, it right. Look, real so this is it's cream. Like a it is a little waffle. The cream. This is going to be your shell pink. Yep. We have um, light heather and, and we have black. So cute. Oh, you did a little baby pocket here. I, I, you know, I love pockets. <laughs> <laughs> I love them. And so I do tend to put them in almost everything. This is super soft. This is our soft knit. Oh, this nice. is a sweater you're going to wear now and through the spring. I really think so. And on if, you know what's interesting? In Southern California, like if you're in Malibu or you go even to Santa Monica, mm -hmm. at night, I need a sweater. It's chilly. It gets yeah. very, very chilly. Yeah. I didn't realize, growing up in Colorado, I didn't realize like by the water at night, it's usually cold. Mm -hmm. So this is that kind of piece I would even wear then. Now this is what I'd wear on my boat. It, you would wear this on your boat? Yes. So, so boats got an engine. And a Sail sailboat has sails. Has sails. Yeah. Thus and, the sailboat. Yes, I remember walking into the <laughs> marina in Santa Monica and there were huge yachts there and somebody went like, and that's ours. And I said, oh, you have a boat. And they looked at me like, it's a yacht. You know nothing, darling. And therefore, you will not be invited upon it. There, that well, was very funny. That's a boat. We you had this super that. duper, duper, duper <laughs> old boat that we loved, but it was 44 feet. So it was a yacht. Is 44 feet a yacht? Yeah, that begins, the, that's part of the yacht size. So we would say yacht. Now we have a much smaller boat, so it's a boat. <laughs> just, we I got smart like, oh. and got rid of the yacht. I but trust us, so our excited. yacht was like from the 1960s. It was really I old. was all excited that somebody had a boat. <laughs> Who knew? Anyway, so this is a waffle stitch, which is a really great stitch. I mean, can you guys get really close on this stitch so we can show why we call it? It's like, it's got like, it's kind of like a little waffle right? Super, super soft, very easy, boyfriend hem, right? Little kangaroo pocket, because apparently that I'm into that right now. Clearly, you had <laughs> Clearly. a phase when I'm you were designing of the pockets. Yes, I'm going, apparently I'm, I'm having a moment. <laughs> you know what the interesting thing is about a v-neck? Because we have now for you two different v-necks, right? Different colors, but both v-necks. And you'll notice I do a fair amount of v-necks because I did a survey. I'm always really interested, like why should I talk to myself when I can talk to my customers? That is what I love about social media because I'm able to ask people, well, what do you like? Mm -hmm. So we did a survey, and a V-neck is the number one neckline. It's my favorite. Okay, so let's see if you told me the same reason they told me. Um, I like it because it elongates that's, my neck. Yeah, that's what everybody said. Yep. So I love it's elongating. And in fact, and I hate a crew neck. Nessie, like I, I like your hoodie because it's got the hood, which helps frame the that's face. So interesting. Nessie, I like I your turtleneck because of the same thing, but I hate a crew neck. See, and I wear them all the time. Isn't that funny. It's different strokes for different folks. It but works. the majority like the V-neck. Majority did, yeah. So, but because it is elongating, and by the way, if you go onto hsn.com, I have really cute dickies that you can put under it as well. But it is really great. And what, you know what look I love? Is anyone styled that way, Victoria? Did you do it? Nope. I would have thought you would have thrown a little tee under that or something. Well, see, that's what a crew neck white tee would look great. It'd be adorable. Yes. Well, that's what I do with them. I take little crew necks and then I put them On under it and I get that yeah. kind of layered look. Yeah, very cute. I yeah. love that. Yeah. Um, uh, also, just want to show you, I, I love the the way you've scalloped the bottom of it right so that little kind of finish to it the length is 27 and a half inches now i love our models almost all of them are tall we do have one petite model with this of course which we love but i want you to see it lands in the right spot so for us average size kind of girls at 27 almost 28 inches it'll give you the length on the back and the length on the front that we're comfortable with and it's double extra small two three x in terms of sizing and this is once can you they're saying on my card a loose fit would you consider oh that? yeah Okay. Absolutely, like you could go down a size if you wanted in this because it's a drop shoulder. So whenever you've got that drop shoulder, you have room. So if you're saying, uh, -huh, go down a size, you can, absolutely. Oh, good, okay, great. And there's plenty of stretch in it as well. 
All right, Pat, what is, well, I'll give you an update. In the black, we're around 400. In the cream, everybody's loving the cream tonight. There's about 300 left. The shell pink, that's really limited. We're at 255, and this Heather Gray is only 250. And that's for everybody. I mean, that's through all the sizes that we have. It's all the four colors we have. I would definitely take this back, especially if you did the ivory or black. Now, obviously, you can tell I'm pretty much in love with my outfit tonight. I love these joggers that I have on. But look how cute. Again, if I didn't want to wear the hoodie that matches it, I could go back here, and I could go back here. And That's I adorable with that. I didn't that think it's styling it that way. Isn't That's that cute. super, super yep. cute? And again, these are still available. If you missed out, we featured them in the first hour, and we've got three different color options. Love. I love this whole thing. But again, what a fun... Thanks, um, Pat. They're popping the information out on my outfit. Um, what not that a fun little alternative look? And it's, a, it's funny because it's relaxed, but just a little bit dressier because it doesn't have the hood on it. Yeah. And the waffle knit. Although to me, when I put a hoodie with a blazer, I I don't think of it as dressing. I don't either. It's just a thing. But the problem is most people, when they want to do that look, because I've seen, you know, you see it all over Instagram and, and Facebook and all that kind of stuff. The problem is, is people use an, a, a, a too cheap hoodie. You know what I'm talking about? Like they try to get like a hoodie you wear to a football game. That is not the kind of hoodie you want to wear. You want to wear something like you have this beautiful sweater knit. Well, this is one of the reasons I'm buying it tonight. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Because I have a really black, a beautiful black blazer that I love. And I've been dying to create that look. It's kind yeah, of a it's longer a great look. look. It's a great yeah. look. And you know what? Next month, I have a sleeveless piece coming in. It's not a hoodie, but it's like a drawstring at the neck. Mm. But it has that same feeling. It stands out like this one, but okay. with a drawstring that's made to go under a blazer. Ooh, girl. Oh, Hark. Might How someone bring a blazer next month? <laughs> Hark. Hark. Might I there actually be bought one of your blazers. I brought a burgundy blazer from you. Uh, oh, again. In the, the Luxe Crepe. Yep. Love it. Right. Did you get the matching pant? Nope. Oh, you should have. No. Yeah. I didn't want the pant. Well, it's really good. It was too sooty. Sorry. Do you did, I, don't I have a, a jogger that goes with that, too? <laughs> we're not even talking about anything we're supposed to. Do I you know, know I'm that? sorry. Like, it, you well, when you brought up the blazer, I just remember I bought girls. your blazer. <laughs> it's just, we're just two friends talking clothes. Victoria, do you care? See, Victoria's mic'd. That's why I keep tossing to Victoria. Yeah. Because she is, so we have talking models, like as if any of you don't talk, because I've been back in the model's room where I'm not supposed to talk. be, but, you know, it's again, it's Pedro says I don't follow the rules. No. I had to come say hello to everybody. It's been so long. Mm -hmm. A dickie under this would be cute. Yes, I would love that. Like a little pop collar, you know, Then you could be also very, very preppy. I, exactly. As soon as you said it, I was like, yes, that would have been but perfect. But now, see, this has got a kind of preppy feel yeah, to it, it doesn't does. it? And I love like, the and cut. it covers your bum. It's literally everything I love in a shirt. The v-neck, the drop shoulder, the um,